Hello and welcome back, Sutherland here. Let's play some more of our England campaign in Europe Universalis with the new El Dorado expansion. We're currently trying to beat up on France. Um, holding them off is more like it at this very moment. Um, we're not actually blockading here for some reason. Only 75%, that's a little strange. That's okay. Uh, we don't need to block blockade Provence anymore. Uh, Burgundy is trying to beat up on France as well, which is a very, very, very good thing. We're going to go ahead and employ our boats to get an extra cavalry down there as soon as possible. Get in my infantry there as soon as possible as well. Um, make sure that I don't take any unwanted... Well, unwanted attrition and unwanted battles. Get out of here. Yeah, so... I really need Burgundy to come and beat up on France a little bit. They definitely have rebuilt some army here. Alright, Hungary is still at medium. Still way outnumber me. I've only taken out a few loans. Not a ton. Occupy Paris is a mission. I'm going to go ahead and take it. Free 5 prestige in a couple months when this thing falls. By a couple months, I mean probably a couple years. Alright. With this cavalry and this guy, I should have enough to start start occupying. Now, hopefully, they did just all leave. So, you know what? I'm going to risk this. I'm actually going to leave them in burn. Or Armagnac. Don't need that many people stacked up where I know I have attrition. Or uh, can suffer attrition. Let's take you to Limousine. Let's take you there. Yeah, yep, that looks good. Sure, Hesse, why not? Alright, I am actually sieging this now. So I'm hoping that Burgundy kind of protects me. I'm going to hopefully get some vision on what's going on here very soon. There's Hungary, finally, showing up just in time to break my siege, I bet. Let's, let's get up there as fast as possible. We need Hungary out of this war. There's, yeah, it's not going to happen, though. Okay, good. It looks like they're fighting Burgundy, not me. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at this. I'm just going to stand right here and wait for this battle to end. Actually, I can join this battle. Weird. You know what? I'm fine with it. It's going to be a uh, bunch of attrition if I don't get out of here fast. We will. Alright, let's chase this guy. I don't know where he's going for sure. Where are you going? All the way to Normandy, huh? Okay, that's fine. Fine with me. Hmm. All right. So my next goal, got to get Ile de France down. We're going to just split this army in half take the half with the leader down here same thing with this guy <coughs> we're gonna siege a couple of things at a time not too much they do have a bit of an army I'm really hoping Burgundy does me a solid here sieges up some stuff Any shot you want to come play? No. Oh, yeah. Maybe once I get a little war score, they might. Which really means I need to focus on Ile de France. That is the number one. No. No! Stab hits? Seriously? Come on. Stab hitting peace deals. Man, I need to. I really need Ile de France to fall, like, right now. 
It's not going to happen. I'm going to end up losing all of my stability. Hungry is medium. I think I'm willing... Let's see... Yeah, they're not quite willing to take a concession of defeat. I really don't want to fight them at all, though. Yeah, they're going to attack here while this... Really? All right, Hungry. Concede defeat. War reparations. No. You can't concede defeat and war reparations? So close. Only five reasons. I don't think I can get out of here in time. Can't put a leader there, because it's not my stuff. Um, let's see. November 25th. If I move south, I'll be gone on the 23rd. Excellent. You move straight in there. Move down. This is going to be a pretty important battle. I'm going to need Burgundy in here, I think. Maybe. Hopefully. Maybe. Burgundy. Come on. Or maybe I'll win without them. Okay, I'll win without them. Would have been nice. Oh, there we go. Nice battle. Whoa. Oh, but I lost this one. Alright, so I need to move this whole group in here. And start re-sieging Ile de France before they start taking stab hits again. Alright, uh, I definitely need to reduce war exhaustion. That's a must. Some tech. Ooh, I could take military tech 4. Perfect. So good. Alright, let's not get, not get complacent here. Hungry. I think they actually got a little bit more enthusiastic. Just hungry. So close. Definitely after this battle. I may not even need it. Let's just clear the offer. It's just white piece. Come on, hungry. You know you want to. All right, this this will do it. No, I don't want to just send a three stack there. What am I thinking? All right, let's uh, select the army. Let's see. I'm going to... Yeah, let's consolidate for sure. Let's wait the one month, and then I think Hungary will get out of this. This probably is going to be a stab hit. National unrest plus two or lose 33 prestige. I'm fine with 33 prestige. There's the accept or the uh, white piece from Hungary. We will take it. Great. We're just gonna hit this. Okay, good. It wasn't a stab hit. That is surprising. And guess who's sieging this now? Oh, me. I really thought it'd be Burgundy. Awesome. Okay, so we're gonna detach a siege. And we're going to chase down little French troops. And make sure they don't reconquer stuff. I And I'm really only going to focus on sieging the one thing. I need this war to be over like 10 years ago. Though we're not doing too awful. I do have... Uh, I haven't taken a ton of loans. I think I can cancel my military access with Burgundy and be fine. Yeah, we can get it. We can get it again. I don't think it's gonna hurt too much. Oh, I still have dudes just standing around down here. I need to I need to reincorporate them into what's going on. Maybe I'll just set them here and let them resiege. Uh, yeah, military access into Burgundy would be nice right about now. I'd love to crush that little army.
All right, France. This is a bad move. Negative two terrain. A big stack next to you. It's still not really going to matter that much now, is it? All right, let's take this stack. Let's move north. You know what? Let's just, uh... I'm never going to resiege that back. Let's just take this whole army. Move north. No peace. Start hunting down little one stacks. Actually, I'm going to definitely hunt this guy. He's probably going all the way to Normandy. Families left behind. Um, national, national unrest. National tax. Yeah, tax modifier. It's fine. We can always do war taxes, especially since I have tech four. All right, Burgundy, come on. France is making a fool out of you. Here I am kicking France's butt, and you're just letting them seed your stuff. There we go. Burgundy's help, helping out a little bit. Now, I think I could have, I mean, maybe not in this playthrough specifically. I could have won this without Burgundy interfering. I'm not 100% on that, to be honest. I know it's possible. Okay, bye bye, Burgundy. That's fine. You're going to have some stuff. I feel like I want to split off. Just enough to siege something else. Just to really kind of help out that war score. All right, where are you going? I'm chasing this down for sure. Maybe I should siege my own stuff back so that I don't have so much war exhaustion. It's not that much. It's mostly from attrition, really. I'm really hoping Burgundy just kind of white pieces. That would be great. Peace isn't happening, France. We're, we're in this. We're in it to get the personal union. All right, let's head back up here. I think they're probably building some more troops. All right, recall that diplomat. I think the only way I'm actually getting into this war, them into this war. Oh, so close. Is to grab a diplomatic guy. I'm not going to do that. I'm making money. That's awesome. All right. Let's just continue with the status quo here. I could... No, I really want to do... I'm going to siege something in the south here. Make sure they're not building up a big army here. Maybe free up some of my ships. I could. I have extra money, and I don't necessarily need troops. I could always take out a few loans, but I could also just build some more barks. Be a little conservative. I'm not going to spend all my money doing it. But having a few extra barks kicking around, it's not going to be a bad thing. Uh, Lollard Heresy. Um, tolerance of the true faith. Yearly papal influence is very nice, but I really don't think I can take the local unrest right now. How am I doing? Not good. For how long? 20 years? No. Not dealing with that for 20 years. Oh, right. There's Ile de France. There's my five prestige. All right. I'm already at 24 war score. The ticking war score has just started. Take Alan Cone. 
owned by England. Yeah, it's going to be a while before I do that. Vassalize Scotland would be nice. Alliance with Tyrone. I'm going to leave these options open for now. I am, however... Really? Burgundy's going to siege back my stuff? Oh, thank you, Burgundy. I'm actually just going to head towards Barry. I'm going to be careful. Uh, I don't like just sitting around here like this. Let's take these guys out to siege there. I wouldn't mind giving them one cavalry, but we'll give them a weaker cavalry and we'll move on. Let them siege. Should really focus on inland stuff. Siege is faster and then I can just win. Hmm. Tech cost minus 10% for a little per uh, little points and gain some prestige, which I don't really need. Where am I at on my tech costs? I'm probably actually not going to be getting tech anytime soon. How long? 30 years. I'm very likely going to be getting tech in 30 years. I'm gonna I'm gonna take the risk. It pays for itself with one tech. I'm probably going to get two. No, I did end up there. They're sieging. Okay, I'll siege over here. Okay. Lose war exhaustion, which I can pay for, or just gain manpower, which I have no way of gaining. Gain manpower. Alright, they're hanging out in Ile de France. It's time for me to go up there and squish. Before they consolidate in too big of a... Too big of a group. I do have some money. Don't think I need it for troops. Do I have any loans? Do. I only have four loans. They're doing two years. So I think... Building barks... Is the best thing I can do with my money right now. Building a few extra troops would be nice, but I don't want to build mercenaries. They're expensive, and I want to get myself out of this war. Occupied by Burgundy. Oh, man, that's that's kind of tough to tell the difference in color there. Can't go there. Can't go there. Damn it, Burgundy. Quit letting them. Stand around in your country. Actually gonna make it to France pretty or Il de France pretty easily. I'm gonna end up having to just chase them down. No peace. And they're gonna duck back into Burgundy. <laughs> Maybe I should have access with Burgundy. This is making this kinda kinda tough. What is it that Burgundy wants out of this war? A lot, actually. They could take a ton of stuff from France. Is it possible for me to fight them if I win? Me and France combined, they're regrouping pretty hard. That's a tough choice. I'd really like them to just peace out, but I have a feeling that they're just gonna just destroy France. Maybe I ought to let France, just before I win, or peace out, maybe I ought to let France actually build up a little bit of an army. Peace them out. Attempt to re-stabilize stuff. Walls are breached here, that's good. Only have 29% war score, unfortunately. So they're nowhere near piecing out. So we'll just have to see what Burgundy can do. 
in the meantime. I may not even have to do anything with it at all. Alright, won that. I think they gave up on their Siege of Barry. Maybe I ought to go siege that for myself. So they can't. Do have a Norman nationalist uprising at 70%. Yeah, not much I'm going to be able to do about that. Could un unsiege it. Or I could let the rebels do it and then just fight the rebels. Burgundy may even fight the rebels, who knows? No peace. Okay, I can't just sit around here. Let's let's uh, detach some more guys. Mostly mercenaries. To soak the attrition. One cavalry. Take the bigger one with the leader. Go smash some more. I can't let them coalesce yet. Not quite yet. Love them to have a decent army to fight Burgundy. I'd love to have a decent army to fight Burgundy. Pet Burgundy has a claim here, too. No, they don't. Okay. Who else are you fighting, France? Burgundy, Hesse, Baden, and me. Right? Ah, oh, you're building up a decent little army there. 33%. Alright. Well... Alright, one another siege. Great, that's gonna send some boats out for me to smash. Not that I really need to smash them, considering they're gonna be in a personal union with me. Maybe I had to stop doing so much damage to them. Um, but I do need them to peace out at some point. And any little bit I can do to them, really, is just a plus. That's good. Let Burgundy do the do the work there. Let's see, how's Burgundy doing? Could I actually fight Burgundy? Burgundy has no manpower, 21,000 dudes. I could probably take out a ton of loans. Probably be okay. Brittany hates me for some reason. Did I ever improve relations with you? I'm not sure I did. Let's just, let's just do that. You still rivaling me? Yes. You still like me all right. Let's improve relations with you for a while. I can call back the guy from Brittany. I think I have to have this around probably 60 or 70 percent. Um, let's see. Military power, prestige. Ah, uh, prestige. Just gonna split this in half. Go sit on Perigore. For a little bit. Not gonna chase that army. I'm gonna let that. Who are you fighting? Oh, Provence? Okay, that's fine. Provence actually really likes me. They won't ally me. Alright, I just need a couple more sieges to finish, I believe. You know what? Let's stop with the Burgundy. Siege back my stuff for me. Thank you. Let's stop with the Burgundy. Let's take a look at how close we may be. Make sure we don't have a we have a clear offer. I definitely want a union with France, which is 84% war score. Negative 63 reasons. So I just I need more war score. That's all there is to it. So what I'm thinking about doing is just re-sieging or sieging up a lot of this stuff so that um, Burgundy can't. Then heading back to the mainland. Which 
I should at least I should probably resiege my own stuff if I'm gonna do that. You know what? Let's uh, detach here. Let's um, go blockade over here so that maybe we can get that done at some reasonable speed. This isn't big enough. I need more people. All right, let's split off one guy from here. Move him down, that should be good. And that's Burgundy's, unfortunately. So unfortunately, I don't have any of their vassals sieged. Not good. Just a waiting game at this point. Start repaying loans, just to minimize some interest. Thinking about booting my military leader. Because the issue is going to be money. Yeah. Okay, well, anyway, I have to take a break. I'm going to consider this. I think if I hold on long enough, I could fight Burgundy. If I re... If I replenish myself... And then maybe Burgundy will peace out. I'm not sure how, how their war is exactly going, how much war score they actually have. They probably have their war goal. Um, yeah, they have their war goal. They may just peace out once this is done. They may siege up some of the, I don't know, some of the vassals. I'm not sure. We'll see how it goes. If I'm going to spend a little bit reorganizing myself. Oh, well, I need to move you all to Dogger Bay. Send you all... Trading. Um, anyway, so we're going to have to re-account whether I peace out. The problem is if I peace out France, I'm going to have to fight Burgundy. Unless they peace out first. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time.